This is Greg with AllNurses.com and we're at the AORN conference in New Orleans. I'm here with David from Nozen. Tell hey. us all about your product. We kind of look at uh, SSI in a little different way. We recognize the fact that these patients sometimes are not being taken care of in a longer period of time the way they should be. We decolonize patients obviously and often right before surgery and oftentimes they're taken care of during that time in the OR. As time has gone on we've recognized that not all of the SSIs are actually taking place in the operating room. With all this technology that we have around here we do a ton of really good work in making sure that the overall operating rooms are good and clean and sterile and all of that. Well these patients oftentimes are leaving there and they're well taken care of in the OR, but actually the SSIs, the surgical site infections, are taking place outside of the operating room, and so we want to protect them over a longer period of time. Our product, Nozen, we put them on a program where for five, seven, maybe ten days post-op, we continue to decolonize these patients during that period of time, and oftentimes we'll actually have the caregiver, family member, visitor, we will continue to have them decolonize as well. It's almost like we put the patient in a bubble sure. and we make sure that these patients are taken care of with good hand hygiene, but also nasally decolonized during a longer period of time so that SSIs don't have the opportunity to take hold. So the way the product works, it's a little ampule. Looks kind of a little bit like salad dressing, you know, like so. We take and shake it up, we flip it around. We have a little pop swab like so and then we go around on the inside, the nares of the nose, like so, on both sides. Pretty quick, pretty simple, pretty easy. But the nice thing is, again, we can take care of not only the patient, but making sure that those that are around them, the loved ones, the nurses, perhaps the doctors, all of them inside that bubble that are gonna go inside that, near that patient, we wanna make sure that they're also decolonized and good hand hygiene. Will we get everybody? Of course not. Just like hand hygiene, you won't get everybody, but the more that you do, statistically, mathematically, the more people that you do, the, le the less likely you are to actually get an SSI. And how long does it last? 12 hours of okay. persistence. We also do some other things. We universally decolonize the ICU so that everybody in the ICU gets nosing as opposed to trying to screen and treat or screen and isolate. And then the last thing we do that's just really terrific is taking patients out of contact precautions that are there for nasal uh, or for MRSA colonization. They don't need to be there anymore. All the donning and doffing of gowns all day with these nurses, they don't need to do that. So we take those patients out of contact precautions and then the throughput within the hospital changes tremendously. So some real key and cool areas uh, that we're doing with, with Nozen that is really, quite honestly, never been done before. Quite unique, quite special. We're thrilled to have a product like this available to the healthcare system. That sounds great. And where can people find more information about the product? www.nozen.com. Great. Thank you very much. Thank you. Appreciate it.